what is up ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the channel so today was a day that uh, well frankly I didn't think I was going to have to deal with for quite some time but um, here we are making a video so yeah I mean as you guys know I built this computer not even a year ago I think we're about eight nine months so we're about nine months in with all these components in GPU CPU all that stuff and Everything's been great until recently. So let me flip you around and show you what I'm doing. So I'm gonna fill you in with what happened. Approximately about a month ago, I was playing a game and I started hearing this fan noise, a very distinct fan noise. If you know what I'm talking about for fan noise, you know what I'm talking about. If you don't, you have no clue, but computer fans make a really distinct sound when they're going bad. And I was like, oh no, it's my AIO cooler because when I put my AIO cooler in originally my screws constantly backed out so I thought I had an off balance fan and finally I got to the point where I was like I put a little dab of lock head on them and it was fine well then like I said about a month ago it started making that same noise again so I took all the AIO apart checked all the fans cleaned all the fans and all the fans I'm talking the two front mount fans on my case the rear exhaust fan and my two AIO and uh, cleaned everything up you know, some rubbing alcohol and put it back together. And it was good for about a week. And then I was editing a video and I had headphone one on one off and it started doing that noise again. I'm like, dang, this silly AIO. So I was a little bit frustrated at that and took it all apart and thought I isolated which fan it was. So I disconnected that fan. I'm like, I just want to see. So I continue editing and it started up again. And I'm like, oh, okay. So it's not that fan. Turns out it was actually my graphics card. So my Asus 3060 Ti, the fans were, I don't even know what happened. If a bearing went bad, I, that's what I think it most likely was. It sounded like a, a bearing going bad. So I made a call to the place where I bought the GPU and asked what I had to do for warranty. And he gave me a few hints that sometimes the screws back out. So just give them a quick little touch on the fans and see if it stops it. So I did that and it was good for a day. Then it started again, and it was it was way worse. So I called Asus and I got it, um, got an RMA issued to send it out. But basically, what that meant is that meant no gaming for who knows how long. So yeah, lame. So I made a call down to the place where I got my original graphics card, and as you know, graphics cards are almost impossible to come by come by right now. So. I, I wasn't very hopeful. I was figuring I was probably going to have to be without for, you know, at least a month because that's what I was told from Asus. So kind of came to terms with that and Buddy called me back and, uh, well, I'm pleased to say this is what we got. EVGA 3070 Ti XC3 Ultra. So, yeah, I lucked out on that. So, um. Yeah, I mean, it's going to be a little bit of a step up from the 3060 Ti. I don't think all that much. I personally don't think I'm going to run into... Um, I don't think I'm going to see some insane frame rate improvements, but I might see a few. But one of my concerns now is uh, getting CPU bottlenecked. So I may end up having to dump a CPU in here, which I wanted to do anyways. So yeah, with that being said, I'm... Um, I'm going to take this baby apart and get it put in and we'll we'll fire up a game. All right. So there we have it. We got her installed. I was a uh, little bit of panic mode there for a minute because I only had uh, one PCI cable um, unwrapped from my power supply. I forgot that it actually had two. So I had to unravel everything and uh, fish it out from the bottom. Luckily, I didn't have to um, replace the power supply. But yes, we got her in and... Uh, Pretty cool. It's got the little fancy RGB on the EVGA, which is pretty cool. Would have been really neat if the GeForce lit up, but uh, all in all, very easy install. I'm really curious to see what the difference is going to be as far as uh, gaming. Because realistically, I, I don't think there's that much of a, a step up from a 3060 Ti to a 3070 Ti. I think it's probably a few megahertz nothing nothing too crazy but um i'm a little concerned now that i might run into some cpu bottlenecking because i am only running the i5 10600k 
I may have to step it up. We'll see. We'll we'll jump into a few games. Uh, so we're getting the drivers installed, and then once everything's installed, we will uh, fire up some some Warzone, some SnowRunner, and maybe some Fortnite, and we'll see if there's any noticeable difference. Like I said, I really don't think there's gonna be, but nonetheless, we're rocking the 3070 now. So yeah, maybe. Um, Maybe down the road when we get up in subscribers, maybe it's going to be time for a GPU giveaway, but that'll be up for discussion in a future video here. So keep that in mind if you're not subscribed because you're not going to want to miss that because as we know, graphics cards are dang near impossible to find. So we might just end up having to give away our 3060 when it gets back. So stay tuned. All right, let's jump into some Warzone here. Let's go and we'll see what sort of difference, if any, we can feel. Really curious, actually. Like, let's open up, uh, where's the, what is it called? What the, that's not my screen. What happened here? Uh-oh, did I screw up on a driver? Oh, no, 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 never mind. It opened Warzone in the background. Bring this to the forefront. And second going on? Warzone? Are you there? Normally this is what happens when I'm going to get an update, so... Bear with me for a minute here. I'll, I'll cut the waiting out. Alright, so I'm going to jump into a game here. I'm not jumping into a game to win. I'm jumping into a game to show you the temperatures and the uh, frame rate. So I did notice the frame rate is a little bit higher. I think I was about 130 and I see close to 190 on here. I am CPU bound. I am at about 83% CPU usage, which is way too high. Uh, temperature's good. We sit about 54, 56 degrees when we're in game. Uh, Sound, I don't hear anything. It's if any you know what I actually think this GPU might be quieter than my Asus. My Asus had a uh bit of coil whine every once in a while. But um yeah, it seems to be good so far. But I will say when I did uh get all the drivers updated and everything, I was having some major I don't want to call it lag issues, but I was not getting a very good frame rate. And it did feel like substantial input lag. Well, it turned out my my BIOS was needing to be updated. So I did that. So once the BIOS was updated, it uh, gave me the ability to turn on um, resizable bar, which apparently is a way of increasing uh, frame rate. So I went ahead and did that and not only did it give me more FPS, it feels like I have substantially less input lag, especially in here in Warzone. I always said to my brothers when I was playing with them that it just seemed like when I was shooting the gun, I wasn't getting the shots off fast enough. And now that doesn't seem to be the problem. I mean, you can see I only played this for literally eight minutes and the reason i played eight minutes because i thought i was recording i forgot to push record so i'm redoing it but um yeah let's uh let's get in here and see what it does you can see we're we're sitting at uh, 52 degrees right now um frame rate in here doesn't mean anything i don't even think the frame rate in the, in the loading screen really does anything but So yeah, it's definitely higher. And I'm running on... I'm running on almost high settings. There's a couple things I turned down. I turned down shadows. And I turned down... I don't remember what the other one I turned down. Ooh, that got just crashed. And did y'all see that? That's not even the loadout I took. Yeah, I want to, um, I, I wish I had the ability to do 
like a side by side comparison, but I don't have to like say that. So. What the hell? I thought I, honestly, I thought I was getting shot through the building there. Get into a game. Let's see what happens. So, dude, we got so much snow uh, yesterday and today. We got a good, I don't know, eight, nine inches of snow on the ground. And it's like minus, here, let me check the weather. It's like minus nine or something right now. Oh, sorry. Minus 11. How about that? Haha. <laughs> it's cold, man. Minus 11. Definitely gaming winter. Moving. Battle Royale. <laughs> So I jumped into SnowRunner too. I jumped into SnowRunner for a few minutes. And um, I don't, SnowRunner's not a very hard game to run. It runs pretty smooth. But uh, they, they put out a new update. There's an enemy team hunting you. So I ended up, I ended up playing uh, SnowRunner for a few minutes. And I didn't really notice any difference in there because right, it's not a very graphic intensive game, I guess you want to call it, so. Hey, what is this? TPSH. We know that's it. Okay. Enemy cluster strike right incoming. Take cover. I think he might be upstairs. Hostile drop it into the area. What were they saying? What is this? I'm gonna take that. Let's go upstairs! Yikes! That gun is quick. What is that? That was. Enemy UAV overhead. It was the PPS. Incoming. Take cover. Come on. And, uh... I don't remember what I was saying, guys. What was I saying? So after playing this for a few minutes. Oh! oh Holy the enemy trackers. Dude, this gun is insane! Enemy UAV overhead. Dude, this thing, I love this gun. Enemy UAV overhead. Don't shoot me, you bastard! It's alright. Get our buddy. We got you, friend. We got you. But um, I did edit a video quickly, and I always use the uh, GPU encoding. Does anyone need this? I think that's what they call it, GPU encoding. Yes, allow GPU encoding. So I always use the GPU GPU encoding through uh, Filmora, and Wow. So I edited a 36 minute video in 4K and it rendered that video out in like three minutes or something. Like crazy, right? So. Guys, where are we supposed to go? So yeah, I definitely think there is, there is a pretty decent um, chunk more power. Uh, I guess it's dependent on what you're doing. Enemy UAV overhead. Gas is closing in. Relocating the safe zone. Any of these guns, guys? I have no clue. One peeps. PSH out again. Going on up. I feel like they might have made it running faster. Soldier incoming. Oh, dude. Oh, can't have you landing on me. Ah. 
Where is this dirt bag? <laughs> Contact. Allied muscle strike inbound. Coming. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Contact. <laughs> he was just right in there. <laughs> oh, I mean, that guy is so mad. Enemy dropping into the AO. Taking fire. Enemy UAV overhead. Okay. Cancel movement. That was hilarious. I want to get those dudes up there. I know he's up there. <laughs> oh god! This PPS H is fire, guys! <laughs> oh gosh, this is hilarious. I'm so glad I turned this on to record. I haven't even played it up even once. I better play it up here. <laughs> Into the AO. Where are you going? Gas is closing. Get to the new safe zone. Fire sale is active. Spy station costs are adjusted. Dude was glitching out. Did y'all see that? Enemy UAV. Holy crap! That scared the crap out of me. <laughs> I almost jumped out of my seat. <laughs> that was so good. Oh man! I'm not even in it to win it. I'm just. Oh no! Did we just get eliminated? Oh no! We got one more guy. I would like to try to go get that gun back. That PPSH is insane. I think I'm going to end up having to put one of them in my loadout. How's everybody doing for kills? Good job, guys. Come on, buy me back. I thought you'd seen that guy in the last second. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to be sneaky, wouldn't he? Oh yeah, he shouldn't have done that. <laughs> rolling, rolling, rolling. <laughs> Save me! <laughs> no! Let me guess! You know what? I better do this speed up before it, uh. Dude, there's a guy below you! To your right! In that building! In there! Dude, he's down there! That's not even your team! Green, there was a guy to your right, right where you jumped up. He was in the stall. He right under you. Oh, 
good. You're welcome. <laughs> I have my voice chat muted for when I'm talking to you all. Well, I think it's kind of rude when people just talk and talk and talk and talk. No, oh, it ding the game, son of a biscuit. Here, found an aid station. Dang it, I shouldn't have, uh, I was looking at the loadout. Somebody save me! <laughs> I'm gonna see how far I can crawl. Oh no! Oh. All in all, you know what? I gotta say though, I am pretty dang happy. So I I did really luck out in being able to find a 3070. So I am gonna give away 3060 Ti. I'm not sure how we're gonna go about it. So I'm gonna have to figure that all out, but uh, it's not gonna happen until we get at least a thousand subscribers. So keep that in mind if you're not subscribed already. Um, yeah, let's um, let's let's click one more. Let's do one quick, one more, one more quick one. One second, thought. You know what? I think that's long enough. I'm just babbling on and on and on. I'm gonna edit this up. Render it out, and then I'll see you guys on the next one.